Hello, I'm Dan and Kim here today. Me and Lisa are heading to the Kerry Cliffs um, and we're gonna take the like Kerry, the Ring of Kerry route by the coast. So it's gonna be beautiful. Um, Lisa's never been to the cliffs before, so it's nice to be able to bring her there. It's not great weather, to be honest. So you can see over there, we've got lovely blue sky, but literally it lashes rain every 10 minutes. So we're hoping it's gonna rain itself out before we get there and you're gonna enjoy the cliffs, enjoy the scenery, maybe go for a swim and then head back to Khmer. So that's the plan for today. So we headed out of Khmer along the Ring of Kerry route and we were delighted to have blue skies because the views in Ireland just cannot be beat on a nice day. We stopped off at Derrynan Beach and again in Waterville to check out the views of the coast and there was these seagulls riding the waves and it looked so cool. Also, I don't know what the whole Charlie Chaplin thing in Waterville is. If anyone knows, let me know. If you're visiting Killarney or Kinmare, anywhere in Kerry basically, I highly recommend that you hire a car so that you can drive some of the Ring of Kerry. You'd miss so much of the amazing views if you were just driving by in a tour bus. Although, beware of the traffic and the number of tour buses on this road. The Ring of Kerry was so unbelievably busy and the buses do not always stay on their own side of the road. So you've been warned. So we've just arrived at the cliffs. It took us a lot longer to get here because we ended up going the scenic route along the Ring of Kerry and like enjoying the coastline. And I'm just popping on to say if you're traveling around Ireland, you need to be prepared for all weather eventualities because it said it was going to be sunny like most of the day and just as we pulled in, it was literally like hurricane wind. Show the sky. Let me show you the sky. So you see over there is like black. Over here, we've got lovely blue sky. And then coming over the mountain right now is like rain falling and the cliffs is that direction. So we're hoping we're hoping that's gonna pass by before we finish our little picnic, but you just have to be prepared. Cause you know, if you were waiting for a nice day, you wouldn't go anywhere. So just always have a rain jacket. That's today's top tip. Yeah. When arriving at the cliffs, there's a massive car park with toilets, a cafe, and a cute old bus that you can sit in to eat your food out the rain, cause it's probably gonna be raining. The cliffs are just a couple of minutes walk from the car park and you can pay on your way. So there's a little ticket box after you pass through the car park where you pay five euro per person. While the cliffs and Moher are undoubtedly the most visited spot outside of Dublin, the Kerry cliffs are really beautiful and are worth visiting if you're down this far in the country. There's two viewpoints you can enjoy and you might even spot some puffins if you're there at the right time of year. That was our plan for this trip, but sadly we didn't see any. Be warned though, it is windy. Um, beautiful uh, but very breezy it was so windy like i was here before so not like 100 percent enjoyable yeah i was here a few years ago and it was like lovely weather but today like the wind was so bad like when we were coming in and we were paying he was like um was like be careful now what did he say something about the wind careful of course it was like insane wind like you could like lean over at points and like you were able to do like the thing where you don't fall over because the wind was so strong it was really windy and I'm just not cut out for this cardio life. <laughs> I feel terrible. So we're having two, we're having a second picnic for the day. Second lunch. <laughs> yeah, second lunch. But we've like pulled up, we're still in the car park, but we've come down further where it's quiet. 
And I've got a lovely view out on the like Valencia Bay, is it called? Because that's Valencia Island over there. Right there? That's Valencia Island that, with that hill on it. Okay, then yeah. So I don't know, yeah. That must be I don't know actually. That's Port McGee down there, I think. I'm not clear. <laughs> so we'll enjoy our food and then we'll head on. So on our way back to Kinmare, we stopped off at White Strand Beach so I could get a quick cold water dip in because it's literally one of my favourite things to do. And then we stopped off in some tourist shops for a quick look because I also love looking in the tourist shops when I'm travelling around Ireland and I highly suggest that you do as well. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, like and subscribe and I will chat to you after.